Let's go, bub. What's going on, you guys? Welcome back to the Scott Barnes Show. And in today's video, we're gonna be doing something fun. We're gonna be doing something a little different. And we're gonna be doing something definitely Marvel. And in that, we're going to be doing uh, the Wolverine trim to my beard. Now, this is something that I've always wanted to do. And about a year ago during October, I actually did the Red Dead Redemption video game. Kind of did more of a Western style beard trim on that one. But this one, I've always wanted to go full Logan. Uh, <laughs> full Wolverine and I thought I think the beard is in the best position we got a little length on the side definitely on the chin where we're gonna have to cut but also I want to trim up the mustache the hair we'll try to get as best as possible it's not looking you know where it should be for the full Wolverine look but definitely we can capture the beard uh, this is the picture or two that I'm gonna be going off of uh, I, I like the continuity of the beard how it's going up right here to the lip uh, we're going to be doing that one and then also uh, this other one just because he's looking heck of ripped. I've been at the gym. I don't know if you guys have been, you know, noticing, but definitely been getting some gains going on. So I thought this would be a fun video. Uh, so let's get this going. So those are the three points that I want to focus on. My beard, my lip, uh, the hair. Uh, I'm getting that cut this weekend. It's been postponed and postponed, but we'll finally get that locked in. But just for this few couple days, we can trim up the beard. If it goes crazy, we can trim it down. But this is the fun part of having a short beard. We can actually play with different realms and different lengths and different cuts uh, within our look. So that being said, uh, let's get this video started. And really quick, we've got our three second sub count. If you guys can give a sub, I'll give you three seconds. Three, two, one, go. Now there's only gonna be two things that we're gonna be needing today and that's gonna be the clippers and the razor. My game plan for today is, uh, if you actually watched last week's video, I was showing you guys how to create the shape for the small beard. And I'm actually gonna emphasize that because if we look at uh, Wolverine or Logan's picture here, it's very short here on the bottom, and this is where we're gonna start fading in into the chin, kind of giving it like a little bit of a V action going on. So we're gonna start here. We're gonna just, just sort of trim it up. We'll get it a nice line, and then we'll start fading it and fading it in and fading it in, and then we'll start hitting up the lines. So the first thing that I wanna do is, I'm actually gonna go, I'm looking at the picture here, I'm actually gonna go, no guard, and I'm gonna trim up this neck portion of the beard, and we'll start going ahead and hitting that up. But let's go ahead and throw in the time lapse. Just go ahead and sit back, relax. Let's see how we can get this thing looking. Now, I just wanted to stop right there and I wanted to give you guys kind of a little bit of a tip when it comes to these kinds of trims. First, take your time, don't go fast. If we start going fast, you can't go back and fix the problem. Second of all, I want you guys to understand is I'm, I'm trying to go for um, the consistency in his look because Logan has different um, lengths in his beard throughout the series, uh, Wolverine slash Logan, but um, the consistency in the chin uh, is always there and he has a similar uh, beard patch that I have and right here it's just a little blonde and if we add a little bit of dye it'll you know help us out but what we're trying to achieve and this is gonna be my next hit is the soul patch I haven't had a clear soul patch in a while this is gonna be a really weird uh, phase but I just wanted to ramble a little bit so my next uh, cut we just I just wanted to see how short we're gonna get it and we're actually gonna get it pretty darn short here and I'm gonna come down I'm going to trim this up. I'm going to go back and then we're going to hit the soul patch in this next um, little, you know, time lapse here. So let's, let's go ahead and do that.
All right, now, once again, I'm gonna stop and ramble in this video because it's my channel and I can do what I want. Now, I was actually going to buzz through this and make this a really quick blah, 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 but as I'm diving into it, I'm actually really seeing some key points with the picture that I'm going off of, and as you can see where I'm stopping. So I, he has a very short point right here to the jaw, that I, that, or the chin that I, that I need to go for, and I don't wanna make it too wide. So I think this is gonna be the widest I'm gonna get. We'll go down, and then he's got this like little roundabout going. So we're just gonna keep, keep continuing. If this gets uh, lighter or too, bright, uh, too light for me, I'll go ahead and throw in a little dye, but we'll just kind of keep uh, going at it. And we're just gonna finish this off now in the next segment, and we'll start uh, lining it up, but just wanted to bring you guys there. Every more of a trim, it gets a little better and better, you know? The funny part is, like, I'm sweating right now. I'm so nervous. I don't know why, but I'm sweating. <laughs> All right. I know this is taking a while, but we'll get at it. We'll keep at it. One thing I want to focus on now is this. I don't want to go too trucker and have this, like, long... too long of the handlebar that comes down of that, whatever you want to call it. But I'm thinking about putting the guard on, and this is where skill and um, technique come in. So I want you to go, we're gonna go a little longer. Can I get some fade action going on? Now, I did what I wanted to accomplish right here is we went a little thinner down here and then it'll thicken up as we go out. So we don't have too much of that uh, bar top trucker uh, handlebar where it's coming down. Uh, it's, you know, we got a lot of girth coming here on the side, which we want. So I'm going to actually do a couple things here on the side. We'll be right back. Now, I got to say, I'm, I'm digging it. It's not... <laughs> We're where we we're where we want to be. And one last thing for you guys that you know know me, we gotta flex out the sides here. And we'll go green screen afterwards so that you guys can get the full on frontal mode. But so far, I mean, I'm feeling pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love it. And we definitely left some, but we're gonna we're gonna have to put a little bit of <laughs> a little bit of darkener there. But I don't know. This this is this is what comes with the mistakes if we have to do it. But we had to do it. Uh, we'll fade it up here just a little bit. Dang it! I thought I thought I would have a little bit more of a dark spot there, but we'll definitely have to add some uh, hair dye, if you will. So. That being said, uh, last thing that we're gonna do is, oh my God, I can't believe this. Uh, let's go ahead and clean up the uh, sideburns. We're gonna go ahead and fade up just a little bit. That way we can emphasize the, the chops here a little bit.
All right, so we're just about there. Uh, last thing I wanna show you guys, I got a little bit on here, but um, I wanna show you guys kinda how to emphasize if you got a little bit of a patch and you, <laughs> you wanna make it a little bit more noticeable. I'm gonna get a Q-tip here and we're gonna play around with some colors, but. All right, lastly, we're gonna go ahead and shape up the neck. <clears throat> and I think we'll have a nice, good look. Uh, Tell you the truth, so let's get this going. Am I looking like Logan? Am I looking like Wolverine? Come on, bub, let's go! And that's what he says. He really, Wolverine doesn't have very many lines, you know? He doesn't have like a, you know, Captain America line. Captain America doesn't have any lines either. Now to finish everything off, looks like Wolverine's gonna have a crew cut for this one, so he can get over it. But that's what we're gonna do. If this was longer, I would be able to, you know, brush this back and brush this back. Might be able to have, uh, you know, Wolverine's classic look. But for what it is, I think we did a pretty good job. Let's throw it over the green screen. We'll kind of do a recap and see if I can finish up or you know maybe even tighten up anything that can make it look better. So here we go. Let's go throw it over to the green screen. The full on swing, right? We totally went opposite of what I usually do with the handlebar and the full thick beard. We just got rid of the front, but this is the fun part about the bearded journey, right? But we got to do the uh, the Logan look, the picture that I was going for. All right? <laughs> Not. Not picture perfect, but pretty close in my opinion. And for me, this is something that I wish I would have done a long time ago. For you guys that get in the same, I don't know, kind of a stale mood when it comes to your look, there's always some fun things that you can do. This is a perfect time to do it. We're in that March kind of isk time where there's really no beard season to go around. So I thought, let's give it a try. And another reason why I wanted to do this was because of what you can do with your tools. So I go over time and time again, I'm actually one of the only YouTubers that actually will cut, trim, fade, color, any part of his hair for you guys to show you that it is possible to do home care for yourself without having to spend the big bucks and having to go out and waste your time and money having a bad haircut or a beard trim where you can do it yourself uh, where that vision that you have can actually come true and look as beautiful as me. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was definitely fun for me. Go ahead and make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. We're just here having a good time like always. So have a great week. Have a great day. I love you guys and I'll see you on the flip side. See ya! Ha!